this video I'm going to talk about the product item content now um, this element isn't used inside the theme for the moment because the shop is relying on uh, default WordPress uh, in combination with uh, WooCommerce and nothing from the page builder is used in uh, that size I don't know except pages like uh, uh, cart or uh, checkout process so to s to show you this element uh, to explain you what it does I'm just going to uh, go back to the dashboard I'm going to access the products of the WooCommerce and I'm just going to choose the first uh, product right here and what you have to do is to enable the page builder in edit mode so I'm going to enable it, this button will appear and uh, you just have to edit this page with page builder. Great, so I have to hide this uh, header so I can be able to uh, edit this behind. I'm going to first add a, a custom subheader right here so I can have a uh, uh, more style page of course and then I'm simply going to add the product item content and as you can see this is it it will automatically add all its content now in case you're wondering okay but I could have just done this uh, very easily let me just show you how a normal product page looks like uh, just again go to the and I'm going to choose this one for example because uh, it does not have the page builder enabled uh, on that page so I'm going to click on view product right here and as you can see basically the same actually this one has a sidebar too but the advantage of uh, page builder is that you can you have access to all these elements here I mean this is a lot you can do awesome things with all these elements and customize this uh, you can have a better subheader uh, element uh, customize it you can present products differently you can also add a sidebar a five sidebar if you want but of course this is not recommended so to add the sidebar just resize this column to eight columns and I'm going to add a new column I want to add it here but it will be added at the bottom because it's fully 12 in size by default so I'm just going to say 4 as you can see it has moved here because this one is 8 and 4 equals 12 and I'm going to uh, add the sidebar and as you can see as easily like, uh, like, that, like that I just created the page and now I have access to all these elements right here uh, you can build a home page if you want I mean everything from the home page you can add into this page so it's pretty much special um, it's um, it's a cool element and it's a cool way mostly because of course of the page builder which you gives you the ability to build uh, custom pages with uh, um, different layouts or for example something that I'm uh, in love with and like doing is to customize the subheader for example I like to have a bigger subheader with an image on the background so just for example if I'm selling this record for example I'm just going to add an image here and customize it and make it beautiful and so on but I don't know perhaps I'm a I'm a, too much of a designer so um, that's why I have these uh, fixations 
so uh, this is it this is the uh, product item content and this is how you can build a product page with the page builder so if you have any questions feel free to um, to ask me and if you have any troubles with the element simply subscribe to our support forums and my colleagues will uh, assist you there so thanks for watching and see you in the next one bye